Hello and welcome back to Jelly's Nails. I hope you are here for some pink macrame today because that's what we're doing. And we're going to start with Unicorns Are Real from Sinful Colors. This is a two coat polish. If you look on my middle and ring finger, you can kind of see it's a little patchy there in the middle. So it will take two coats to get full coverage on this. That is the first coat and we're going in with coat two. And as you can see, the patchiness is gone now. So it is a two coat polish. I actually really like the formula on that one. And there it is next to the bottle for a swatch. I'm going to go in with my Setch Feet top coat because I forgot I'm mad at it. <laughs> so I'm using it in this video. And I'm trying a new holographic glitter. You can't t really tell it's holographic there. Uh, it's a fast dry formula from Wet n Wild. It's actually a really pretty glitter. It did take two coats to get it as uh, glittery as I wanted it. But that's what I like about it is you can build it up very easily. And we're going to use the plate from the March Manny by Me box. And I'm going to use all of these different macrame designs. Uh, some people said they see shawls that look like this, that people on the border wear shawls. So I thought that was a really cute idea too. And they posted actually a bunch of really pretty colorful ones. And I'm going to pick up the design and just stamp straight up and straight down. This is a monotone design, so it's not going to pop out at you. But I like that. Sometimes I like a little subtlety. And that was a mistake right there. It picked up a big old blob. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. This particular design, I had to scrape side to side instead of up and down. So again, if you have that problem while you're stamping, try scraping in a different direction. And a lot of times that'll help you get a cleaner pickup. And again, straight up and straight down. And you do press this pretty firmly on the nail. This one I also noticed is easier if you go side to side. A lot of times if the designs are really intricate, scraping side to side instead of up and down will fill in the image better and make it easier to stamp. And we're going to grab that last pinky. Again, you have to scrape it to the side. I was trying it again just to make sure. And everything picked up beautifully when I scraped it in the correct direction. Maniology, I've never had a bad plate from them. I've never had a plate that didn't work, so I think it's a brand you can trust. And it is latex booger time, so we're going to peel off the first one and use that to grab the ones after it. It's so nice because it really sticks together quickly and easily. It makes it very easy to peel it off. Instead of having to scratch and dig it off of each one of your fingers, it just pops right up. And as you can see, I had some polish on the side there that was kind of dried. So it left a little bit of a mess we're going to clean up. And that's really from just doing so many layers with the latex on there. Um, if I changed it out in between or not used it as early in the process, it wouldn't have done that. We're going to top coat again because we want to make sure everything is sealed in. It also helps that hollow glitter pop out at you. There is our finished design. I hope you really like that. You can see it better up close. It's very pretty in person. Kind of hard to pick up on camera, but I really liked it. I thought it came out well and it was cute. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you'll click in the upper right hand corner and watch another video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.